Okay. Hi, everybody. It is time to read a story with Miss Megan today, and I have two helpers that are going to help me, Landon and Libby. Hi. Hi. You can say hi with your words. Um, This is called Truck Full of Ducks, (laughs) and it's one of our favorites, and so we have a little truck right here, and we have a little ducky, and we're going to read Truck Full of Ducks. Ready, set? Yep. Okay. All right, guys, help me with the words if I need help. So on the first page, it says news and stuff, and there's ducks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten ducks, and they're all stacked up in the doorway. And now there's a dog pictured, and he's the boss, and he says... Thanks for calling truck full of ducks. We'll be right there. And he's on a telephone. Okay. And it goes munch, munch, munch. And it says one truck full of ducks delivered to. And the ducks ate the directions. Oh, no. So they're all loaded up in this truck. And it's a truck full of ducks. And they're driving Oh, no, the directions. Don't worry, ducks. We will find the customer. This way, that way. This way, that way. Yep, and they're at, what is that, Landon? It's a stoplight. A stoplight. Yep, stop. What color is stop? Red. Good job, Libby. And what color means go? Green. Green. Good job. Okay. Did you call for a truck full of ducks? He's still driving in his truck, and all the ducks are just sitting there happy. No, not me. I called for a mail truck. And inside, there's a little girl standing by the mailbox, and she's got her brother in a box, and it says, One brother, please mail very far away. (laughs) Why? Was that very kind? No. No. Mm -hmm. She's being silly. I don't know what I did that to you. Okay, did you call truck full of ducks? And the guy that they're asking is using a jackhammer. He's a construction worker working on the road. And he says, duck truck, not me. I called for a dump truck. Because he's being jerked around by all of his machinery. So his voice was funny. And there's a picture of the construction site. I know, but it's more important that the video can see. Okay? Okay, perfect. All right. Did you call for a truck full of ducks? And now the boss is asking a shark and a pig that are wearing surf gear. Right, guys? Mm -hmm. No, dude, not us. We called for an ice cream truck. And they're at the ice cream truck getting some sweets and treats. Who called for a truck full of ducks? And they're driving away. One of the ducks stole some ice cream. Actually, a couple of them got treats, didn't they? Mm-hmm. Okay, let's see. Did you call for a truck full of ducks? And he's at a, a boat dock and talking to a pirate. Mm. Arr! It wasn't me, matey. I called for a truck full of crackers, not quackers. (laughs) (laughs) Quackers. That's silly. Yeah. Did you call for a truck full of ducks? Sorry, Earthling. They're asking an alien. He's got how many eyes, Landon? One, two, three. Uh, How many on the dog, Libby? One, two, three. Good. 30,000 light years away, huh? This is going to cost you. How many legs does it have? How many One, feet? One, two, three, four. Yep, four good legs. job. Four Does legs. Really have four so the legs. tow truck, Tony's towing, is towing away the spaceship that yeah. wrecked, huh? Not a truck full of ducks. He called for a tow truck. Yeah. <laughs> the party bathroom. Who called for a truck full of ducks? And there's so many ducks on this truck. The truck is leaning sideways. 
It says, you're in luck. Last potty for miles. Miles. <laughs> miles. So they're at a rest station. How many are there, Lyndon? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, there's seven. Hey, you're 27. Is there seven? Yeah, Wait, yeah. We count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Actually, one, skip one, two, three, four, three, four, one, two, three, four. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, yeah. Good job working together, guys. Hurry up, ducks! We're going to do toilet paper, guys. The toilet paper's coming <laughs> under the door. I, He's so funny. Oh, my goodness. goodness. <laughs> Those ducks are coming out with all kinds of silliness. Oh, good, good. One's wrapped in toilet paper. One's holding a newspaper. I <laughs> that. I got it. Back in the truck, the clock is ticking. <laughs> you got the giggles. Did you call for a truck full of duck? A truck full of ducks. Hey, Walter. Who's Walter? Yeah. Walter must be this guy. Yeah. Arr, no more ducks. Well, that's Walter. Oh, hi, Fred. You're right. So, Walter is this duck, and Fred is this duck, and they're talking to each other. Mm-hmm. Arr, no, no more ducks. I called the duck removal truck. It takes all the ducks away. They're sucking them out, and it, there's a sign that says, do not feed the ducks by the pond. <laughs> Why? I don't know. They're just silly. He's got a megaphone now, Boss Dog does, and he says, did anyone call... For a truck full of ducks. What does that say? It says deep, dark woods. Did you say truck full of ducks? Yes, truck full of ducks. That was me. Who do we think it is? It's the fox. Uh Uh-oh. And they're driving in the dark. And the ducks look very scared in the back of the truck. Deep, dark. Good. Yep, over here. And the signs say caution. Dead end. One scary way is the address. No Wi Fi. Hungry Fox is the name on the on the mailbox. It's the fox. Okay, ducks, out of the truck. See, I told you not to worry. So the boss has fulfilled his order, and the ducks look very scared, and they're walking in. And the fox. fox says, perfect timing, my dinner. Uh-oh. Look at his sharp teeth. He's got sharp teeth. Let's turn the page. Bath Is bath over bath. time for my bath. bath. <laughs> they just went there for a bath? They just went there for a bath. They... They made it sound like the fox was going to eat the ducks, but that was just being silly. He just wanted a rubber ducky bath, huh? Yeah. That's silly. All right. Bath time gig, Stan? You know it, Frank. You know it, Frank. And they're driving away from each other. I know Frank. I Stan. Mm Mm-hmm. See? Yeah. I know they're talking. Good job. All right. Thanks for calling oh, truck full of ducks. We'll be right there. Not the duck. <laughs> oh, boy. That's a silly book, huh? Yeah. By Mommy, Ross Burrock. Mommy, Hold on. We're going to show. So in the story, we worked on counting. Yes. Um, and we could use puzzle pieces or we have like magnets. You could count one, two, three. And talk about how many ducks were in the story. Go up to 10 if you want. Um, We could also talk about the parts of the duck. Ducks have heads. They have beaks. They have a tail. And they swim in the water. What is the ball for? Oh, I think that's just here for fun. And then we have a truck. And so your, your student or your child could be feeling the wheels. They could pretend to put the duck on the truck. And all of that during the story. So... (laughs) I hope that this helps give you some reading ideas. I hope you liked your story with Miss Megan and Libby and Landon. And we miss you guys. Say bye, guys. Bye. (laughs) Thanks for reading with us.